age was not a hindrance for 58-year-old Nanay Nanette as she strived to reach her dream in becoming a lawyer. She was among the around 11,000 bartakers who took the exams last Friday and Sunday, which was held digitally and in regional locations for the very first time. Even if she is nearly in her 60s, she can still keep up with the youth in using technology. They were also trained by their school on how to answer digital bar exams. Dili dili uh, regarding sa ko and dili ko and dili ko dili ko kanahan ko anjahin sa technology ni embrace gyud ko niya. In fact nga ni sa akong pagtag sa first na akong curriculum ko angan jud pudi man ko do unta ko computer. Di skila jud ko imbis mo graduate ko 6 months ni graduate ko 1 year and a half. Kay para lang gyud makuf up na ko ang computer. Kay na ni understand ni nako di naman di naman ko ana man gyud na siya kinanglano na man gyud na sa so dili para nako sa dili sa nako hendra sa ako idad mm -hmm. kay ang akong ang akong kami nga goal kon unsa gikinalan ana ako so maning pamot ko nana akong kuan nana ang akong kanang pag pag approve pag kuan ba pag dawat sa challenge a graduate from the University of the Visayas in 2011, Nanay Nanette is a second-time bar taker and she said that even if she already has experience in taking the bar exam, it has still been a very difficult journey for her, especially after experiencing the wrath of Typhoon Odette. Yeah, our challenge is to get up. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm not sure 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 what I'm doing. To our son, 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 or ako gibuhat scroll 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 down sa ako or yes or no basya mo answer sa kung no or yes usap pa nako ang depensa kay tatlo pa nako to asa tong asa tong atong automatic din na repens ako auto so mas and Joseph are also barristers like Nanay Nanet who hope to pass the exams on their third try. They describe the digital exam to have more advantages for the bar takers compared to the previous format that they already took twice. Dili po yun makaingon pero hopeful yun. Uh, sa makatulo naman gudin na ako na take no? uh, <laughs> ako uh, ato kay untag mao na gud untag mao na gud ni gud kay para para malipay na pud ako mga ginikanan ang karon kay ang ako ra yung maingon is mag ganahan gyud ko magpasalamat ni uh, Justice Leonin gud uh, ug iya gud maing gitabangan para ani mao ra gud ako ma comment about ana uh, pareha man gud sila tanan lisod na isod uh, pero karon kay gi ora gid mi ni Justice Leonin ano kay pare man mi kapila na pud kitik retaker man so matagan sa nawa to kay sige ra gam third place sakto unta ni sakto to na unta ni ang mga answer ano ra compare sa to no sa una kay di na maguna na sa mong penmanship same time kay tungod ma review ni mo yung mga answer so Ma-review ni mo niya, ma-erase ni mo niya, ma-ilisan ma bitaw ni mo. Dili para sa una nga, once nga, mahuman na ka sa, sa isa ka number. Yan, murag ma, kuha na kag-erase ba kayo, na-erase sure na, mahuga ni mo ang sir. Pero sa, karoon na bar kay, ma-review ni mo. So, tanaw ni mo, uy, karong grammar man dahil ko, yun na. So, ma-review ni mo. So, kana, ma-review ni mo yung answer niya. Pag, kuha na na, makahuna na nagig ka nga. Kung mag mong pakos sa barani, sayo na gud akong answer. Okay. Nanay, nanay opportunity to review your answers gud. So, compared sa previous na bar karon kay mas nindot karon kay kana ma-review ni mo man sa kit. The normal releasing of result is usually 5 to 6 months after the exams. But due to the digital conduct of test this year, it is expected to be released earlier as examiners can check the answer much quicker. And the firm is a program that is launched by the IBP Cebu City chapter. And this is to guide and to also provide a venue for um, law graduates and for those who are bar under, under uh, or, or bar takers, no? Um, and also even young lawyers um, who are looking for a career path and who are also looking for opportunities, um, both employment or otherwise. Uh, 
and so that we can also match them with their strengths to other law firms, uh, government agencies, or political or or private corporate agencies that need the assistance or the need the services of uh, paralegal, or those or, or of lawyers also kanang na legal needs. Um, so amos lang imatch dito and so that they can already be guided on on their employment status while waiting for the results of the bar. On the other hand, Oliva said that although her heart broke when she found out that 219 bar takers were not able to take the exam after testing positive of COVID-19, she stands with the decision of the Supreme Court in disqualifying the examinees who violated the honor code for deliberately entering testing centers without disclosing that they have been previously tested positive of COVID-19, smuggling mobile phones inside examination rooms, and accessed social media during lunch break inside the premises. I completely support the Supreme Court on this one. Um, as lawyers, the only thing that we hold as um, lawyers is our integrity and our honor. And without these, then uh, you cannot really uphold the law. Uh, there are so many interpretations of the law, and you have to do it with honor and integrity um, to uphold justice in our society. So without this, if at the stage that you are still taking the bar, you cannot follow instructions, you cannot honor the regulations um, already imposed on you, then it means you will, not, you will, you will also be a bad, uh, rotten lawyer in the future. So it would be best that as early as you uh, as you were trained in law school, you will already perform the duties and responsibility of a good lawyer in our country. This has been Shereza Mioi from my TV Cebu.